everyone, my name is Michael, or you can call me Embryo Designs, and this is another mock review. And if you don't know me, I'm a big fan of the new uh, CW Flash show, and yeah, it airs on CW, but uh, I'm a really big fan of that. It's a really good show. If you haven't seen it, you should really, really watch it. It takes a lot of inspiration from the comics. And I am always happy when yeah, comic book shows actually do that because there have been some TV shows and movies that don't really take things from the comics, but I'm just happy when they do. For example, this is the Cosmic Treadmill, which has been seen both in the TV show and the comics. This is uh, the treadmill that The Flash trains on to come up in, in his speed and just evolving. So for this, I actually have the Flash minifigure and my custom, or not custom, um, yeah, Flash streak. So it's just a basic technique by using, we'll try to show, it's kind of difficult showing uh, with transparent pieces. You take a one by two plate, um, around the stud one by two plate and just continue that uh, until you have something like this and with the fact that he he has yellow marking markings on his body uh, I actually added in some yellow streaks in the middle so yeah but I will put this to the side and focus on the actual treadmill and I was really surprised how much, uh, how good this actually turned out because I did not actually think this would turn out this good. Uh, first of all, it actually works really good. The treads uh, just turn really smooth. I will actually take them off to show you guys how that looks. And you can probably figure out how this is actually made from just seeing that. And also this sticker is from the 2012 uh, Quinjet, so from the first Avengers movie. Yeah, so yeah, that is the control panel I used for this. And yeah, the actual treads are actually just attached by this so if I put that back I actually built it in section so this is just the base and in this 3 by what is it 8 space this will actually pop in so we'll just put on the treads off camera yeah but it was really fun to try to make this because I try to look at both the comic book version and the uh, TV show version because they actually look really similar. Um, and if you're wondering why it's hollow here, it's just so the actual treads can spin without uh, getting stuck on studs underneath or anything like that. This only sad thing is, as, I, as you probably saw in the beginning, when I took this out, it kind of breaks apart easy in the back, but with the fact that I used this as a display piece, then an actual uh, playset or yeah, something I play with, uh, it doesn't bother me that much, but uh, I'm just really happy that the treads actually spin really well. So, always happy when that yeah, something turns out for better, but you can, yeah, if you really want to do a scene from the actual TV show, you can put the flash on here if you actually want to stay on the treadmill, something like that, and also put uh, some boxes here in the, uh, um, in the background. Yeah, I actually posted a picture on my Flickr, so yeah, go check that out and. I put up my custom Barry Allen minifigure. I don't have it with me right now, sorry for that. But I also added a couple of boxes in the background because he used that if he ever 
um, stops and the treadmill just continues, he will crash into the box and that will soften his crash, I guess. Uh, I'm pretty tired, so my grammar isn't that well, but yeah, in my opinion, it has never been, so yeah. Um, so that is all I actually have to show you guys in this video. Um, if you like this video, you should probably check out my time room, uh, another CW flash mock that should be uploaded as of the time of this video. So, uh, please check that out if you have time. And uh, yeah, please rate, comment, and subscribe if you want to see more. And I will see you guys next time. Thank you for watching, don't forget to click the subscribe button and also follow me on my social media, I have a link to all of those down below in the description. So see you next time guys.